everyone. Um, I just popped up to my local park, which is Geraldine Park in Southwark or Lambeth, near the War Museum. Let's see that background, the War Museum. And I always tend to go for a bit of walk around here, the, the Tibetan Peace Garden. The His Holiness, the Dalai Lama opened up this place in 1999. Uh, we're in 2018. It's a lovely uh, apple tree here. Um, magnolia. Look at that, so peaceful. If I go around, let's go back a bit. And there's a kind of a statue monument here by the Dalai Lama. So if you push the garden from this side, I made a mistake. I should have recorded this video back in a couple of months ago. Then I could have shown all these lovely roses here. Unfortunately, they died away because we're in the month of uh, September now. So first, second, first week of September 2018. As you can see, all the uh, all the flowers has died away, so they just cut back. So I'm entering the the, the peace garden here now. As you can see. Let's go back a bit and let's just slowly. As you enter the garden, it's a, a lovely, lovely sight. A beautiful sight. Nicely laid. Excellently designed. So on this um, type of boulder or concrete uh, wall, you got this wavy sort of curved into the uh, the stone, and basically lovely flowers here. So it's like a round circular garden surrounded by lovely lovely plants and shrubs and you know all the rest of it and it just sort of goes round it's such a peaceful place you can actually s sit on um, Um, those stones you can literally have a pick up a book and just sit and read and you know all the, all the rest of it right. as I walk towards the middle of it you can see there's a, like a round circular type of right, a kind of a gate with what looks like Tibetan writing or could be Hindi writing. Such a calm area, such a beautiful and calm area. You can um, just um, in the summer, especially, you can get lost in here, lost on your own world. You can imagine in the summertime, the flowers would be blossoming. It's unbelievable. 
But even though in, we are in autumn now, and still we have a hint of flowers here. So look at this. I do that. Move around a bit. Such a lovely, lovely, lovely feeling. Uh, so I'm going to go backwards so you can see the full length of a such a lovely, like a circular a garden, the design, absolutely breathtaking. Right, as I approach the, the, the monument, uh, I think it's inscripted in Nepalese. And here you can see the Dalai Lama signature probably there on here. Lovely, so it's all scripted in Nepalese writing. And, the, uh, and in this side you got a Chinese, one side you got Chinese writing on it. Chinese characters here. Again a signature there. And on the other side it's Hindi. Uh, written in Hindi, this side is Hindi. Same again, his signature here. And hopefully that should be in English, yeah. It's on this side here, yeah, exactly what is translated uh, in English. So, all the side has three languages. Hindi, Chinese, Nepalese and English. On the, the largest stone. So, thank you so much for watching this video and all of my other videos. Please click like and subscribe button and I hope you enjoyed this one. And I'll hope to do other videos for you. Sorry I couldn't do it in Bengali because a lot of my audience are, they speak English. So, it will be a disservice to start most of the people will not understand so I probably loaded another one in Bangladesh